Hello, it's Lala. It is Tuesday around 5.30 and I am starting my gingerbread house, AKA charcuterie, charcuterie, I always have trouble with that word, but I'm making a charcuterie chalet. So I'm going to um, just begin by showing you ingredients. I'm gonna do this again in steps because it's gonna take me a while and you don't wanna watch like a two hour video. But anyway, I'll piece it together. So I'm starting this again for my works um, gingerbread contest. And I know it's technically not gingerbread, but neither is candy you put all over a, one made with pop tarts or made with uh, um, graham crackers, right? So if, if those count, this is gonna count. So um, that's the first step. I'm gonna show you the ingredients, hang on. Okay, I've already made my base, so, so I got me some crackers, some cheese boards, this is gonna be my firm base. Got some little breadsticks or biscottas, some pretzels, I'm not sure what I'm doing with that yet. My cheeses, this is gonna be my roux, my summer sausage. This is the glue. Got me some feta cheese for snow. Some brie for snow on the roof. Make me some snowmen out of some mozzarella. And um, anyway, that is going to turn into a charcuterie chalet. Okay, so I got this piece together. It was really just some double stick tape. Okay, now I'm gonna glue, not with glue, I'm using Philadelphia cream cheese for my glue, the spreadable one. I, I, I think, I don't know how they did it. This is just what I'm thinking. To get my this be hard to do. pretzel sticks, my big long pretzel sticks to stick to the wood. Oh, crap. oh that's not coming out very easy. You know, soften up. I don't know what I'm doing, I'll be honest with y'all. I saw a picture and I thought, how hard can that be? <laughs> you know how that can go. Okay, this is gonna soften up a little bit. I'm glad I didn't get the real block. And they're not gonna line up exactly. Probably should've done that one the other way. I'm probably gonna have to go get more pretzels, so what I'm thinking. I don't think I got enough pretzels. And this clearly needs to be a little softer. It's taking some serious strength, which at the end of the day, I don't have much of it. Okay, I'm gonna do all the way up. Bought these little, I don't know what you call these, I think that'll be my roof, maybe. And I'm gonna use these probably to, to, I don't know. I haven't figured that part out yet. But this is this part, so that's what I'm working on now. Well, can you see that freaking mess? The bug bu uh, bag busted, which might work better with just a f knife. I don't know, that bag might not be worth it. We'll see. Anyway, it did bust though, so. All right, so I got it built. This is some um, wasa crackers. I did the pretzels, the little lady finger things here in the front. Had to make it all fit my, um, my whatever. And uh, I guess I gotta, I gotta feel that. I'm gonna feel it the same way I did the other one. Um, which I'll show you real quick how I did it. Oh, dang it, I knocked the thing on the floor. You just, you know, put and what whatever this sticks out looks like snow, so it's kind of cool. Um, you just put this on here, I'll like glob it on. I gave up the uh, pipe and bag, as you can see. This is a lot faster, a lot easier, probably more sturdy. And I guess I don't know how to freaking save this thing. I guess I'm just gonna cover it and put it in the refrigerator um, when I'm done because it's edible. And um, we're gonna eat it at some point. So, 
So, um, I mean, I don't know. Maybe it won't be that good. I'm going to have a lot of leftovers. But, um, anyway. So, I did, um, Wasa, kind of at the edge. Oh, this one's shorter. I'll have as much space. That's weird. And then I'll do one of these little melvas. I am going to do, make a chimney. The picture I saw had a chimney. Um, but I'm not sure how I'm going to do that. I thought I had bought some cheese to do that. But anyway, that's where we're at now. I don't know if this, if, I guess this will be the front because that's the yard. And, um, but anyway, I don't know. What y'all think? I don't think it looks half bad. Okay, can you see that now? See, a little summer sausage for the shingles. Front, because that's the yard. And um, that's my charcuterie chalet. I gotta make a door. Not sure what I'm gonna do for my door. Might use these veggie straws. Um, but anyway, I, I don't think it's half bad. I wasn't quite sure I'd better manage this, but um, I, I think it's looking fairly, fairly decent. And um, once I get all this done and some little trees and snowman, um, we'll come back. And there's um, just the, the leftover cream cheese I had, which wasn't much. Well, um, Parmesan sprinkled on it to kind of give it that fresh snow drop look, I guess. Cover up. I just got to do a walkway, some snowmen, and some little Christmas trees. So, Lord, I'm going to have to wash my uniform. I'm all messy. But anyway, um, kind of excited. Hope everybody else is uh, impressed as I am. But, you know, we don't know. Okay, we're about to see the final result of the um, wine drinkers version of Gingerbread House or Chartreuterie Chalet. So, um, I've already sent the pictures. So, um, but I'm still not posting this just yet. I'm not going to post it till the results are out, which is, I think, Friday. Um, it was going to be Thursday, but we have a big event on Thursday night. So, um, I'm going to stop it and start it again and turn it around and show you the end result of my charcuterie, charcuterie chalet. Okay, here goes. So, we have some... Um, rosemary and some little grape pots with pretzel sides and um, that is a summer sausage with cheese and jalapeno in it and all the um, the white is cream cheese that is my quote-unquote glue that is a, um, a little tip of a pepper for the door handle um, and the little snowman who Appears to be melting because he probably is. Is um, goat cheese? I tried to roll in three balls, and the buttons and the eyes. He he is a little deformed there with one eye bigger. Um, it's chocolate, and the nose is actually a tea tiny piece of carrot, and the hat is a piece of grape. So it's just cream cheese, um, Parmesan cheese sprinkled on the cream cheese and on that part to make it look like snow. Um, this is some little biscotti, um, what you call those finger things? This is wasa crackers. This is just those little bitty tiny square crackers. I don't know what they called. Um, and that pretty much is it. So, um, I'm about to wrap it up so it doesn't dry out too much and it still should be fairly edible. I think, I don't know. Um, I have leftovers if, um. If it's not, but anyway, that's my little um wine version of a uh, gingerbread house. The back, I didn't, you know, it's it's not as neat as the front because it doesn't show. But that's it. So toodaloo. See y'all next time.
Peace.